everybody, it's Vicki. I'm back out at Fall Creek Falls State Park again today, and uh, I'm going to be taking two different short hikes today. We're going to start out on the Turkey Pen Ridge Trail, which is about a just a little half mile trail that connects to the Woodland Trail. And then uh, we're going to make that little loop and come back, and then we're going to head over to the nature center area um, and we're going to do the pawpaw trail so um, that's another uh, two and a half mile short loop so um, we're going to try to get to that today and um, it's such a beautiful day uh, we're going to have some temperatures in the 70s today so i'm really excited about that so um, let's get out of the car and let's get started this is a really nice trail. It's nice and level. It's a wide trail. You can walk two people side by side on it. Um, my husband and I like to come out and uh, run this trail. It is a half a mile long, so you can just run it back and forth until you get your mileage in for your run. Um, and it's just really nice and level. A lot of times you'll see deer on this trail, especially right here at the beginning, even though it is next to the road. I know last year there were a couple of three deer that were always just right in this area just about every time we came out. And I've not seen them so far this spring, but we'll but it is a little bit later in the day and it usually is in the morning time when you see them the most or late in the evening. It's just so gorgeous out here today. Much needed after all the dreary weather we've been having. sky up above us. And sunlight coming through the trees. Okay, we're coming up on the Woodland Trail. So we're going to take a right <clears throat> on the Woodland Trail, which is going to take us back over toward the Nature Center. But then I think just over the little hump here that the trail is probably closed because the trail that goes over to the nature center that is um, because I know the trail that the swinging bridge is closed so we'll see okay so yeah the trail um, over to the nature center is closed they're doing some work on it but uh, so we will just go to the right which this is just going to make a loop so we'll just go to the right toward the Fall Creek Falls uh, gorge let's just take a look at the uh, Cane Creek Falls overlook A little side trail off the main trail but uh, maybe it'll be worth our while today looks like it's pretty rocky going down so I may just stop 
filming and meet back up with y'all when I get down there. back on the trail nice little view of Cane Creek Falls from the other side of the nature center gives you a little bit different view of it and then I think just ahead of us is going to be another side trail to another uh, place where we can look off at the Gulf and probably see Fall Creek Falls. Okay, I am going to try to make it out to the Rocky Point Overlook, but I'm not making any promises because I think there's quite a bit of a rock scramble and I don't know if I want to risk it today. So I'll get down here and look and see what it looks like and let's see there's like some branches down and stuff sure I want to attempt this today. I'll get back with you. Well, I think my days of going to the Rocky Point Overlook may be over because the trail is Actually, I'm more concerned about being able to come back down through there without having a terrible mishap than climbing up it. So, I think I'll just, even though it's an awesome view from over there, I'm going to skip it today. Oh well, 
leave it for the younger folks. Well, we made it back to the junction of Turkey Pen. So let's take a right and head back a half a mile to the car on the Turkey Pen Ridge Trail. Okay, that was a nice hike of the Turkey Pen Ridge Trail and the Woodland Trail. So now I have driven over to the Nature Center and I'm sitting in the parking lot and I'm going to have some lunch before I start the Paw Paw Trail. And um, I just bought, brought me some um, Star Kissed lunch to go packet that I'm going to have and some Doritos and then for um, dessert a Snickers bar. So I'm going to have my lunch real quick and then we'll get started on the Paw Paw Trail. Time to start the Paw Paw Trail. The first part of the pawpaw trail is a little wet and a little uphill. So this is really about it for the uphill part of it. I don't know if you can hear the water rushing down there. can't see it from here, but you can hear it. You can also still hear traffic. The trail has become a little stream. I'll just walk alongside here until we clear it. Sometimes you can see where it comes out of the ground. I don't see that right now, but okay. Still a little, still a little mushy. Nothing much has bloomed out here. In the valley, there's all kinds of red buds bloomed. But up here on the mountain, everything's just a little bit behind. It's kind of hard to tell, I know, because it's so thick. But um, we are walking just right around the rim here. You can kind of see the other side over there. The other side of the mountain. But it's pretty pretty steep. Pretty good drop off down through there.
Well, let's see how this little creek crossing goes. I don't think it should be too much trouble. But you never know. Just like I said, you never know. Let's see here. I'll hold here. Sit there. Okay, successful.